the key to growing your business fast is focus. Relentless, over the top, crazy, crazy focus. Now, there are many folks who will look at me and look at all the stuff that I'm doing. And the first thing, well, it's like, you're over here, you're over here, you're over here. And that is true. But what people miss is when I came on YouTube, 2009, 2009, 2010, 2011, I was 100% all in on storage auction stuff. That's all I talked about. That's what all of the videos are, were up about. That was the focus. And you got to have that kind of focus to break through because you're competing with everyone online, every meme, all this attention. So I just did it, did it, did it. First year, 59,000 views the first 12 months. But I was making money because I was selling a product. But as I was saying, people will look at what I'm doing and then think that they could copy or emulate without the decades of business experience that's behind me. Hey, this is Glendon Cameron, founder of HustlersKungFu.com. Be sure to get your free 19 business courses. One of the few links below. And I ask two things of you. If you find value with the courses and if you find value with the channel, refer two or three of your best friends to the channel. And one more thing, if you find value, once again, if you find value, I would like you to pay what you think this information is worth. So with that, let's jump into the video. If me doing something like, I'll create a product in a heartbeat because I love testing. This is fun stuff to me. And someone else will do it, but I've got a sandbox to play around in. And you need some level of testing because I'm in a group and the guy said it. Many people talk about testing, but very few people do testing. And I've pissed off a bunch of people with my testing. I've had you know, folks just like, don't email me anymore and all this other stuff. And that is cool because see, another thing about focus is you must continue to get new customers into the pipeline, new leads, new prospects. Between YouTube and hustlerskungfulifeskills.com, I get anywhere from 60 to 180 new people a day, seven days a week. So when I do testing, and this goes back to focus, I know that I'm gonna lose some people, which is cool. You can't keep everybody. Everyone's not a customer. And I know that if my testing doesn't get put me in the negative, whereas let's say I bring on 100 new people a day, 100 new people a day, you know, via the email list, YouTube channel, hustlerskungfulifeskills.com. And that's, you know, 3,000 new people per month, 36,000, 40,000 new people a year. Let's say I lose 10,000 because someone will come in on a video where I'm not cussing as much. And then they'll see that, damn, he says fuck quite a bit. And they're gone because they don't like that. Or someone will come in on a video on a topic I've only talked about once and they would go like ah well I want more of this topic and he's not talking about it then they're gone hence the reason that I created this playlist how to start a business fast anyone that comes to the first video more than likely is gonna watch a few because they're all talking about the same thing various aspects and that goes back to focus and if you're gonna be a youtuber and you don't have playlist, you're fucking up. Playlist can rank and search. Playlist can get you more subscribers. So if you don't do them, you, you're really, really messing yourself up here. But essentially, you gotta have that high level of focus. And one of the things that happens with a lot of people online is people become get money hustlers. And what, becoming a get money hustler does to you is it puts you in a mode where you're always reacting uh, there's this new there's this new video Amazon has a video service I'm a video guy 
I looked at it and when I saw that they had to have captions it's it's on my list of things to do but it is so far down the list because I can tell you now I don't know how Amazon's video service works and this goes back to focus but I do know how YouTube's uh, captions work and I know that captions for are great for folks who are who already know who you are if you don't set up your video correctly it doesn't matter if you have you know you spent 30 bucks having it captioned no one's gonna watch it I mean it's, it's just a really really interesting thing but I think Amazon might be a player Facebook might be a player but the whole thing is what is my focus my focus is on hustlerskungfu.com and associated companies that is my focus so me going over to Amazon video and you know right now I'm actually going to talk to a supplier me pulling focus from that to do Amazon when one it could be a big hit it may be it may it may not be I don't know but I do know if I focus going back to 2009 2010 2011 with relentless determination I will break through so whatever business that you're trying to set up you got to focus on one or two things and that's it uh, multiple streams of income if you're an internet guy that doesn't come until you nail down your first stream of income that's got to be the first thing that's going to drop you got to nail down your first income stream you you have to be making the kind of money that you want from your first income stream before you jump off into the second income stream and I see people doing that with little regard to what is the five-year goal what is the ten-year goal or what is the big want you may not have five-year goals you, you might, your big want might be you want to own a ranch in Montana and everything that you're doing is geared toward you're buying acres you're getting cattle that's your big want um, you know some people operate on that I operate in 5 10 15 20 year benchmarks for goals because that works for me it may not work for you but everyone's different but you gotta have that larger vision that impacts everything that you're doing because when you have focus and then you have that five-year plan ten-year plan or that big want you don't do things that distract you from your plan but many people online do a lot of things that distract them from the main plan and then they wonder why it doesn't work out or I'm not making any money and I'm gonna tell you a little secret because this is something else well it's not even a secret if, if you're a business person you, you should know this you will get faster traction in person for your online business than you will online there was another group I was in and someone was talking about a internet uh, SEO agency called him or a social media agency called him and the guy hit him back like well if you're so good with social media why are you calling me on the phone good question and if the person on the other end had been properly trained they would have said well we like other companies have found out to reach busy decision makers such as yourself that a phone call is more expedient more than likely you've seen us or heard of us but you're so busy running your business you just didn't pay attention and that's where we come in to help you do this thing because you know social media is powerful right get the prospect to say yes and you know you want to be utilizing social media to the best advantage right and you get the prospect to say yes again every time you get the prospect to say yes you're doing micro closes you're getting them to agree with you so if you can get a person and this also works with checks if you can get someone to make five to ten micro commitments or micro closes it's much easier for the big close much much easier and that's what you have to do if you are a salesperson but going back to focus if you do not really really know where you're going it's pretty damn hard to get there now my thing 2009 conundrum media I still communicate I'm getting ready to release some more books but they're gonna be different because the new focus is on hustlerskungfu.com. The brand. 
that's the new focus and you know there, there's all been all kinds of stuff that you know people are like well what about this you used to be just Glendon Cameron and those people don't really have imagination nor they have a larger purpose because many times when you judge someone you're judging someone through the perspective of your experiences and your abilities so it makes it real hard for you to judge someone who is above you or doing better or is on a completely different level because you're going to be judging it through that myopic filter that you call your life which may be big enough to judge the situation or it may not be but building a brand and this goes back to focus and I, you know i keep saying focus because part of marketing is repetition so this video is about focus and you'll hear me talk about focus and use focus quite a bit because as i focus on the brand i build something that doesn't exist and i create energy and i create a position and i create a higher level of value I can sell my stuff for much more than if I was out here chasing trends or I was a get money hustler or, and I didn't have any direction and I didn't have any focus if I was just out here just doing stuff to do stuff then yeah it would be somewhat of a challenge for me to consistently make money but since you have a plan and you have focus and relentless determination to stick with the plan because this is something that happens when I bring on a new consultant client. Everybody wants overnight results. Overnight results usually are totally unrealistic because if you have a business that has been doing things a certain way for a certain amount of time, it's usually gonna take weeks and months for you to turn the ship and to install new habits, to put in new processes, and I'll give you a great example. In my videos, you say, hey, this is Glendon Cameron, founder of HustlersKungFu.com or HustlersKungFuLifeSkills.com. I have to remember to say that, and I also have to remember, be sure to get your free 19 business courses. I have to consistently say that and a new wrinkle is I'm gonna start adding that to the end of the video it's gonna be at the beginning of the video it's gonna be at the end or possibly it might be in the middle I'm gonna start doing that and the thing is I need to put in another thing but this is with focus and relentless determination that you can go ahead and sign up for the courses while you're listening to the video because when you click on that link it opens up a new screen new window if you're on desktop or if you're on uh, your tablet phones that might be a little dicey but I need to put it in there because people are like I want to do that but I want to listen to this video and they don't want to leave the video since you know marketing is repetition Marcus is you know relentless determination focus by focusing on that and I can tell you I used to get 10 to 12 signups for the course per month before I started doing this with consistency every day now I get between 28 and 40 new signups and the difference is I've been relentlessly and consistently putting that in the video that's the only difference uh, videos actually I'm making less videos and there's a few other things I'm doing but once again when you focus on your business when you know where you're going it makes it easier to do certain decisions but if you are in the get money hustler phase where you know you just getting money all money's good money which you know you can get money and you can make money to pay the bills you can get money to pay the mortgage but the thing is when you build a brand you don't have to keep repeating building the brand you build a brand you get it to a certain point then you market the brand and if you continue to market the brand it gets to a certain point where you don't even have to market the brand anymore have you have you ever seen a Porsche commercial no the brand is at such a high level that we go look for the brand it doesn't come out and have to meet us on the street because of the marketing that they've done for decades so that's the power of a brand 
at some point you can get your brand so powerful that it markets itself automatically like Apple you go out you see someone with an iPhone not only do you see someone with an iPhone it reinforces the Apple brand you're out you see someone with a iPad you're out you see someone with a MacBook Pro all that plays into marketing because you see that little lighted up Apple on the back of the MacBook Pro and it's marketing you're like oh that's Apple that's what Apple does and that is the beauty of building a brand and that is the beauty of focus you have to know what you're doing and where you're going